Veterans competing in the 25th National Veterans Golden Age Games were treated to a traditional Hawaiian send-off as they prepared to embark on the Outrigger Canoeing Expedition. Unlike traditional canoes, an Outrigger has support floats attached to the hull of the boat to help prevent it from tipping. The event is fun, safe, and easily accessible for all veterans, regardless of their age or physical condition. The veterans navigated their way out into the ocean and traveled along the coastline, enjoying the spectacular view as they moved along. It's really nice going into the water, you know, and uh, once we got out past those uh, buoys or whatever they are up there, and you can see in the water about 30 feet deep, you can see all the rocks and everything. It just we went all the way to Diamond Head. At the Hawaii Convention Center, many veterans participated in the air rifle event, which always makes for tough competition amongst many skilled marksmen. Toby Ruby, an Army veteran and local Hawaiian, is excited to participate and be an ambassador for her state. I want to do my best for Hawaii, and I want to bring Hawaii's um, the best of Hawaii to them and say aloha to them and greet them to Hawaii and make them feel welcome in Hawaii. And in the evening, many chose to attend an authentic Hawaiian luau, which featured many traditional activities, including a tree climber. All of the veterans had a great time, and that's one of the VA's top priorities. Well, I'm thrilled always to go to the Golden Age Games and all of our national events, but uh, this is extra special for me being in Hawaii where I grew up, and I was so proud to show the islands to the folks here, and it looks like they're having a fantastic time. As the evening came to a close, the sun set on another beautiful day in paradise. For the Department of Veterans Affairs, I'm Anthony Hardman.